As the world watches closely, the next generation of British royals is definitely turning heads, especially with Prince George, who is second in line to the throne. It's fascinating to think about how he'll carry this immense responsibility in the future. Tell us in the comments what you think about George's royal journey so far. While it seems inevitable that George will eventually become king, it looks like he won't have to step into that role until he's much older. King Charles, beaming with pride after seeing George perform his royal duties during the coronation in May, is reportedly eager for him to start taking on more royal tasks. In a groundbreaking shift, the king has announced that George won't be expected to serve in the armed forces before taking the throne. This is quite a break from tradition, as royal heirs have historically been groomed for military service as part of their royal upbringing. Instead, the palace says that George will have the freedom to explore his interests before stepping fully into royal responsibilities. How do you feel about this change? Tell us in the comments. It's said that there won't be any expectations for George to take on royal duties until he's well into his 20s, which must come as a relief for a young boy navigating the complexities of royal life. Before George was even made a page at the coronation, both William and Catherine made sure to check in with him, wanting to know if he felt comfortable with the role. It turns out he was keen, showcasing a bit of that royal spirit. There's something quite refreshing about how both his father and grandfather are keen on giving him a voice in how he grows into his royal role. With Catherine and Charles both loving what the monarchy stands for, it's interesting to see how their perspectives differ on how it should operate in modern times. Catherine's influence on George's education reflects a careful balance between royal duties and a desire for a more normal upbringing. While most kids are off to various new schools, George's case is unique. It's clear that the king's words about George's future are not set in stone, and Catherine is adamant that she will ensure her children's welfare, even if it leads to some royal drama down the line. What do you think about balancing royal duties with personal interests? Tell us in the comments. As the second in line to the throne, George will inevitably face a time when he needs to step away from the rest of his family. This has stirred up excitement and curiosity about what's next for the 11-year-old prince. His newfound freedom allows him to explore various interests, and he has already shown a passion for cooking. During a recent visit to a charming restaurant in Norfolk, George was captivated by the kitchen, especially a wood-fired pizza oven, and declared, this is what I want to do when I grow up. Imagine the historical significance if he chooses to pursue a career in the culinary arts. Prince William's own experiences in public service having served in the Royal Air Force and as a pilot for the East Anglian Air Ambulance along with Catherine's stint at a local retailer, showcase the commitment to service that runs deep in this royal family. It's exciting to think that George's culinary dreams could align with a legacy of meaningful contributions to society. What kind of royal duties do you think he might take on in the future? Share your thoughts in the comments. As the royal family continues to adapt to modern times, we can expect significant changes, especially for young Prince George. When Prince William eventually ascends to the throne, George is set to become the 28th Prince of Wales. Alongside this title, he will also inherit the title of Duke of Cornwall. This new chapter will introduce him to a range of royal titles, including the Duke of Rothsey, Earl of Chester, and more. Each of these titles carries historical significance, linking George to centuries of royal tradition while also allowing him the freedom to carve out his own identity. The blend of tradition and modernity in George's future as a royal heir is quite intriguing. His upbringing is likely to look different from those before him, and this evolution could be a game-changer for the monarchy. As he steps into his royal duties, the focus will likely be on how he embodies both his royal heritage and his unique passions. Are you excited to see how George navigates this journey? Tell us in the comments. To wrap things up, the future of Prince George seems to be bright, with plenty of possibilities ahead of him. As he continues to grow and discover his interests, it will be fascinating to see how he balances his royal responsibilities with the freedom to explore his passions. 
let's support George on his journey and see how he shapes his place within the royal family. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more updates on the royal family.